Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. In this video, we're going to take a look at the Atomic Shop as today is Tuesday, and it's a massive, I guess, update. Let's hope there's going to be something new. I kept my first impression. And afterwards, we're going to take a look at the daily and weekly challenges. I'm not going to do the daily ops because, unfortunately, I'm recording this before the daily ops reset because I can't. I have a whole bunch of meetings later on. So let's not waste some time. Jump right into it. All right, so let's start off with the atomic shop, and today we've got oh jacuzzi. I mean hot tub. <laughs> First thing that came into my mind, man. That looks cool. Oh, look at that. You can actually, I guess, buy. Based on this photo, I guess you can interact with it. And your character kind of goes inside the water. 500 atoms. You got a plushie over there, super moon. <laughs> pretty cool. Alright, so the bundle, I'm pretty sure that is included within this bundle. 1,500 atoms, man. Yeesh. So we got this uh, pre built building. Okay, then we got the jacuzzi. I believe this is the door. So the mobile home trailer, the hot tub, then we got the door, I guess the rustic uh, room, ah oh no, this one, room divider, okay cool. Then we got, are those walls included? Brick scooter walls, wild brick floors hmm and this is a six pack loot bag oh it's a loot bag skin that wall looks nice I wonder how much budget it takes so yeah there you go red brick wall with a door and I guess a gate as well or is just that same door is just but you just like put it from two ends. That is actually pretty cool. <laughs> nice screenshot. I like that. Okay, this is actually pretty good. I am I might even gonna actually grab this. But I don't think I'm gonna grab the entire bundle. I think I'm just gonna grab the red brick wall and the hot top. If you think that you would like a review for this bundle uh, comment down below and I will consider of buying the bundle and making a review by tomorrow alright so all these are included within the bundle itself then we got this hat <laughs> it's just a hat straw hat this is pretty old 50% discount. All right, that's cool, but I don't want it. <clears throat> now, for this I, this bundle, I made a full review last week, so this is last week's. Then we got the spring bundle. Pretty cool. But I'm not going to get the Volt Atrium Shelter Red uh Rider Collectron, I guess. Uh Trick Candy Ball, Bloody Arctos. Launch boxes, repair kits, and scrap kits. Don't want all that. By the way, I am going to switch accounts to my wife's account because she doesn't own anything. Because I'm pretty sure there might be something here as well. But it's not visible here because I already have it. And by the way, not always all of the items make it to the, uh, to the featured section. So I would encourage you to take a look at the uh, other sections. And it looks like we also got something free for Fallout first. All right, so uh, all that stuff we got a supply here. Communist collector. Oh, look at would you look at that? APC survival tent. Hello. Okay. So this is a skin for the uh, tent. I'm pretty sure. Survival tent, yeah, it's the tent. Okay, man. So you got 35 days to claim it. 
and by the way if you do not own follow first but you get it right now you can claim the skin oh wait scrap that this is not an outfit outfits you can keep and use later uh, with skins for the tent you can because you still own the skin and you can use it only when you reset the follow first so yeah scrap that unfortunately this is not um what do you call it not a camp item alright but whatever the case is let's go and review it see uh, the thing is previously oh that's actually pretty cool it's actually got a scrapping thing inside look at that what is this this is a scrap box nice can we get that skin uh like on its own individually that skin looks perfect though let me uh, change my secret service helm there you go yeah, unfortunately I don't have a lot of time to make a video today because I'm loaded with meetings at work so that's how it is I think I'm gonna make a separate review for this tent so we got the cooking thing now this is cool I always wanted uh, something like this at the oh I got cockroach I hate when that happens why I once I even scrapped it my own freaking excavator power armor this should not be inside here this atomic shove like it should not it should not be scrappable dang it Ugh. so yeah always wanted one of these workbenches inside our tent now it makes life a lot easier uh what is missing the the regular stash box is missing but yeah there we go that's what we got here man it would be really cool and if in some some future we'll get to drive these things <laughs> Now that would be cool. Maybe in a couple of years it'll be a thing. Like you know, like in a lot of MMOs, like there are mounts. And it would be really cool if you could like drive these cars and stuff like that. That would be cool. So yeah, that's the tent and it's usable only with follow first. So if if you for example claim follow first, claim the skin, uh cancel follow first, uh once your follow first uh ends, you will not be able to use this because uh tent feature is follow first feature okay uh, but if you for example cancel right and then come back in a I don't know in a year or whatever you'll still have the skin available because you've claimed it and uh, you know we all know that not a lot of uh, items return uh, from follow first the only things that I've seen returning is uh, the tents and that's it I haven't seen the most wanted outfit to return, which there were some rumor it was supposed to be June, July. Uh, that was the Elite and the Advanced uh, NCR armor, which it looks like it's not here. But if you're a follow first owner and you see those outfits, please do comment down below because the patch notes are still not up and I'm not quite sure. And I was talking about these armor. So this is the Elite one. Anyway, uh, let's see what else we got here. Um, atomic shop. So yeah, th th I'm actually pretty happy, satisfied with that tent. All right, and the skull mask. Okay, cool. All right, let me switch accounts. All right, so right now I'm on, on my wife's account. We should see everything. Uh, so yeah, this I already reviewed last week. Great hits. We got the Unstoppables outfit bundle which I made the review and you can take a look uh, if you like want at least two of the outfits from here I would recommend getting the bundle because you get four uh, because if I'm not mistaken they used to sell uh, those outfits separately a lot higher and I remember I thought of uh, I calculated the value I don't even remember when I did that I think I did that when I was playing on PC and that was back in 2019 somewhere mid so yeah if you want at least two outfits from here then I would recommend getting the entire bundle 
Alright, uh, so the Volt at Trium Shelter 20 for 20% discount coming up. <laughs> Alright, cool, cool. Uh, Raider Collectron we got here. Or lunchbox and stuff like that. Uh, Volt, we got the Arana Palacia, Greylock, uh, Starlet Sniper Bundle. We got the Flyboy Bundle. This is actually a pretty good one. I really love the the bag. The parachute bag, man, is great. The uh, These four berets, also great. Definitely worth it. And the outfit itself is actually not that bad. Uh, these two bundles are also pretty cool. They got the, their own like sort of a throne and an uh, active emote. Like for example, over here you got this emote. So when you make the emote, he kind of picks up his axe and it makes a really nice uh, emote to spam at the uh, nuclear winter lobby. So here we got same thing, the thrones where you have a separate animation. So like this is wrong by the way. This is not how it works anymore. They fixed it, and now when you sit, you kind of like, actually, hold up. I, I, I wait, I'm on my wife's account. I'll log in with my main, I'll show you how both of these thrones, and you'll see the animation action. But he kind of sits and pulls out his axe, so I, that's actually pretty cool. Uh, the outfit, I don't know, I, I never used it. Uh, stars bundle. Okay, is here top guy and a player icon. We got supply, communist collectron. I guess that skull max that we saw was... Uh, a uh, fallout first thing and we got the hug cut out free all right so I guess that's pretty much it for the atomic shop let's go I'll show you how the animation on the thrones looks like and then we'll jump to the uh, weekly and daily uh, daily and weekly challenges all right so let's take a look at those animations so we're gonna start with a barbarian one because I find it the most pretty cool one so you see but takes out that axe, sits like that, look at that, holding that skull, <laughs> Grand like skull by the way, if you haven't noticed, <laughs> so yeah, that's actually pretty cool, I, I really like this throne, well, chair, or call it whatever you want to call it, alright, then we got the Grillock one, I don't even remember what it does, but it also has a skull, and got the barbarians calling believe it or not I just I just paid attention it just just now <laughs> lol there we go I guess pretty much same thing but instead of an axe is holding a staff there you go but actually man I really like the skulls on this chair look at that and the coming out like steam look at it hmm I don't even know which one's better now and I give my vote to this throne right here just because of the epic looking vampire skulls that skull over there those gems or whatever that's steam I wish it wasn't an act I mean a staff it was being some sort of a uh, two-handed weapon uh, like sword that would be cool but anyway that's uh, pretty much it for uh, these two things that I wanted to show you now let's take a look at the daily weekly challenges and call it a day so daily Complete daily operation on a public team. Uh, complete daily operation. Oh wow. <laughs> uh, complete an event. Uh, do five dailies. This triggers. Kill a legendary enemy three times. Level up one time. Nuclear winter. Kill a creature. Repair armor, weapons, or power armor three times. For the weeklies, we've got. Uh, let's remove that there. Build up workshops. So you'll need to. S I uh, workshop or camp. I would recommend capturing a workshop and just spam it with like display or floor decoration then uh, stairs and stuff like that what's written over here and you'll get it done so that's actually pretty easy uh, collect caps complete five daily operations uh, complete daily so if you will do your dailies today and you will do all five this will trigger automatically as well complete an event 10 times kill 75 creatures kill legendary enemy 15 times I wish this thing was Oh wait, we had this, didn't we, last week as well. And we had the Mall Miner event, which made this easier to do. Uh, level up three times, plant a crop in a workshop 25 times. So for this one, I would definitely recommend just jump into this specific uh, workshop, uh, Billings Homestead. Basically, it's loaded with crops like corn, 
uh, you capture it, take the corn, plant it, done. So yeah, that's that's exactly what I'm gonna do. So yeah, I'm actually very satisfied with this week's Atomic Shop and the Fallout first thing, and uh, I'm really hoping that some of the outfits, the cool outfits for Fallout first, will make a return because a lot of people are wanting to get the NCR uh, advanced and elite. So Bethesda spies, if you're watching the video, <laughs> read the comments. <laughs> and yeah, if you enjoyed the video, you all know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity, as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you want to leave your negative or positive feedback, it's always welcome. Just don't swear. Simple as that. And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Clan on Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Once again, thanks all for watching this video. If you want to join our Discord, feel free to do so. We have a whole bunch of Fallout 76 chats over there. And we got a friend over here who is wearing a pretty cool mask. Oh, it's one of the rare ones. Hello. I guess Z Clan member, huh? Hello. Yeah, so where was I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a whole bunch of the, a whole bunch of chats and stuff like that. But make sure to read our rules, because if you break them, you get banned. Simple as that. So thanks all for watching. You all have a good Monday night. Whatever you guys lock in at, I'll see you on the next one. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future, we'll go.